Well, here's a rock formation that forms a ridge line directly across US 95 from the Lone Pine BLM campground. And I think it's really interesting because if you see that center lump of rocks, if you look at it from the left to right, it is a turned down nose of an Indian's face. And if you look at it from right to left, it is the turned up nose of a European pioneer's face. At least that's what it looks like to me. <laughs> Nobody's ever pointed it out to me as such, but every time I come here, that's what I see. <laughs> As I've been uh, walking through the desert over here on the other side of uh, US 95 from Lone Tree BLM campground, I've been looking in these flat places of the wash for uh, signs of animal tracks. And I haven't really found any that I've recognized at all. Uh, however, it's uh, a different kind of track that I did find. It is a uh, wild donkey scat, and uh, that's kind of interesting. So the the rains were here within a week or so ago, so within about that time, at least one wild donkey has uh, come through here and uh, left his sign. <laughs> well, it's time to go back to the Millennium Falcon and get some lunch. So we're gonna go back through this culvert and uh oh there's a light at the end of the tunnel i hope it's not a train <laughs> i came uh, the other direction i came through the other side of the culvert so i thought i'd explore this side going back pretty uh pretty similar nothing really going on no uh animals or anything in here that's a good thing, probably. And here we are, back on the other side of US 95. <laughs> Yabba dabba do. <laughs> well, I gotta say, today's weather is pretty disappointing. <laughs> this is not the Lake Havasu City I remembered. Nor is it the Lake Havasu City that I left rainy Washington for. Although Washington could be snowy Washington by now and this is better than that. <laughs> it's about only about 50, 55 degrees. Not good! <laughs> Well, do you hear that wind? This old Class C is just a rockin'. Windy, 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 windy. Happy windy Thanksgiving. Woohoo! <laughs> well, I tell you what, I'm thankful that I've got this RV and that I'm inside and not stuck outside because outside would just blow the clothes right off of me and nobody wants to see that, trust me. <laughs> man, oh man, look at this. It is so filled with clouds out there on the horizon looking over towards California. 
that you can't even see the California mountains that are so visible when it's nice weather. Let's go in a little closer and see just darkness, just clouds. Those mountains in the foreground are still uh, Arizona mountains. Back there behind all those clouds are the California mountains. Yeah, well, I hope everyone's having a sunny, warm, happy Thanksgiving. I'm thankful, but ours is cold and wet and rainy. <laughs>
There we can see some of the aftermath of the storm. We've got some standing water in a low spot here. Looks like this side of the, uh, the wash kind of pools up. A little hard walking and keeping the the camera steady. I didn't bring the gimbal. I should have. But yeah, this is the first time in all the time that I've been camping here. This is the first time that I've seen any part of this wash this full of water and. And you can look and see the ground, the wet part of the ground that goes right back up into that little cutout there on the side of the berm where the water came down. But uh, yeah, this is interesting. Come on, you don't need to go over there into that muddy water. Come. Oh, footing here isn't... Uh, isn't too good either. I gotta be really careful. Pretty slippery. Yeah, well, this is a pretty good uh, sized little pond here. Well, I'm laughing through gritted teeth. <laughs> this is not the Arizona weather that I anticipated when I came to Lake Havasu City. This is terrible. It's raining hard. Well, not real hard right now, but it's raining. It was raining hard earlier. The ground is just soaked. And uh, boy, I'm I'm half tempted to pull up stakes and start headed somewhere else where there's more sunshine. And I don't know where that might be. I guess I'd have to check AccuWeather and check the internet and see. But uh, holy smoke, this is less than satisfying. <laughs> Look out there at the mountains. They're hard to see through the fog of rain. Oh, man. Ah. <laughs>